And the world continues to mourn the loss of basketball legend Kobe Bryant. Investigators now working to figure out what caused the helicopter crash that killed Bryant, his 13-year-old daughter, and seven others on board. The group was headed to a basketball game for Bryant's daughter, Gianna, leaving Orange County just after 9 yesterday morning. It was supposed to be a quick trip, but then around 9.45, the helicopter crashed in Calabasas, just north of Los Angeles. Fog was so heavy that Los Angeles police grounded their helicopters, but officials say it is still unclear if weather played a role in this crash. They are mourning around the world. That is certainly true here in San Antonio, where people are still reeling from that sudden loss, especially those who grew up watching Kobe throughout his career. Our Stephanie Cerna talked with some students at the University of the Incarnate Word who are remembering him as one of basketball's greatest players. Since I'm a 90s baby, I've, I've watched Kobe over the years and as a Spurs fan it was kind of it was always difficult because you know it was, it was always a challenge. Spurs fan or not many students here at the University of the Incarnate Word say they have a lot of respect for Kobe Bryant and remember watching him play. I've always respected Kobe's game. Um, he was definitely one of my favorite players too so I mean yeah it was it was uh, it was it was fun watching him as I grew up and then it was just, obviously it was it was just sudden and it was a a bomb that was dropped on everybody is whenever we heard the news. UIW graduate student Charles Moreno is still playing basketball today, but he says as a young basketball player, he looked up to Kobe as one of the greats on the court as well as off the court. He taught me as well as generations of players and even people in general, just like not in, in basketball to strive for greatness, but like in your life to strive for greatness. For him, MJ, uh, LeBron, like, they're all great in their own aspects. Like, you can't argue greatness, but you can argue and say that they're all great in their eras. Plus, they're all great human beings as well. But a common theme throughout the campus today is disbelief. When the news of Kobe's death spread yesterday, many students say they initially thought it was a false report. And they're just devastated knowing that the basketball great and his 13-year-old daughter are gone. Hurt for his wife and like losing a kid and her husband at the same time and all the other people too, just, it was a hard thing. Stephanie Serna, KSAT 12 News.